Hey everyone, what's up? Today I'm going to talk about the movie Satan's Return. And if you're a fan of like something like End of Days with Arnold Schwarzenegger, I think you might be a fan of Donnie Yen taking on the devil this time. Um, he didn't fight Satan though. It would be kind of cool Donnie fought Satan, you know. But it wasn't like that. It was pretty much, it's, it's a simple it's drama, horror, action. A little bit of comedy, not too much, which is a great thing because I usually hate comedies in Hong Kong movies with you would you expect a horror and action element to it, you know, which you see like these early 90s Hong Kong style movies. But this one has a little bit of comedy. It didn't, it didn't overlay it too much with it, which is great. Um, pretty much it's about this female um, has visions of the, these murders and stuff of females taking their heart out. But one of the women happens to be Satan's daughter. Now, is she really Satan's daughter? Anyway, she meets this um, police officer named the Alchemist played by Donnie Yen. I guess they call him Alchemist because he's calculating how we f do his, how we stop crime and stuff. Um, they, uh, and a, a cast of other characters come across a serial killer that, killing, that is doing the killing on, on these females. And the reason why he's doing the killing, taking their heart out, is to see if they are really Satan's daughter. And the, these women are born like, on a sudden date, and it's the reason why they are being targeted, that one of them is happens to be Satan's daughter. Anyway, the first of all, there are your action elements, which is really good, like the kung fu stuff. Um, it has a lot of drama talking, which is alright with me. You know, I mean, when it comes to something like Satan Returns, expect something like End of Days or something with supernatural talking. Um, you get fast forward to the ending when he kidnapped the main woman, and it was about to sacrifice her, and um, the cops had to go to the high rise building to stop the killer, and um, also. They, they even have two zombies in it when, when the killer kills two of the cops, he turned them into zombies. So you got some zombie action going on. And you got a cool chainsaw fight with, with the killer and Donnie Yen. And then you got Donnie Yen holding up a chainsaw. So it's pretty cool to see that. You know, and you never see that in a Donnie Yen movie before. Speaking for me, I never just saw that. Or Donnie Yen holding a chainsaw. So every time there's a movie that I just saw a long time ago, I just didn't remember it until now. Um, you get your twist ending when they save. The female police officer will have to probably be Satan's daughter, who maybe it, it is or is she not? That's why you have to see the twist ending in this movie, which is pretty obvious, but still, it was really, really cool to see it. I mean, it was a simple movie, um, good, 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 good on the end movie. For me, it was a good on the end movie. Um, it's not so action like all the time, like constantly chop sake all the time, but it, the, the action scenes does, when you get to the action scenes, it does make up for it. Like again, I like this movie. I enjoyed it. Satan Returns. Did you back on the early 90s days of Hong Kong style movie made?